in Kenya, youth unemployment is higher than the overall national unemployment rate. According to the UNDP study, 80% of the current 2.3 million people are unemployed as youths between 15 to 34 years. However, this unemployment narrative could change if only the youth could focus on agriculture as a business opportunity. Most of the youth perceive agriculture as unattractive or not as cool. They view agriculture as an incorporation of too much manual labor with poor returns. Fortunately, there is a different narrative by some youths in Nandi County. In Kapsimoto sublocation, we interact with some youths who have come together and formed an agribusiness youth group. Kwanza kabisa, tulianza kikundi hiki wakati tulichita ama tuli tulichukusanya tukiwa vijana ambao tuko tumemaliza tu shule ama high school. Tukawa tu tumekuja village na atukua na chochote tukua watu wanasema asolas tukaamua kuchita tukakuja pamoja na tukaongea pamoja kwa sauti moja tukaanza kwanza na nazari ya miti tukaanza tukaenda kule forest tukatafuta miche ya mti tunaenda tunanua hizo tubes tunaanza na nazari yetu tunaweka hizo miche mali hapa tukiwa hapa saa hizi ni nasari ambaye mali hapa sasa ni mali pa eh, kuweka kawa tunaanza kwanza na nasari hapa hapa ni poropaketa ambaye uh, inawekwa isi kawa ama seeds za kawa na inatunzwa mali pale mpaka inakuwa tayari inaletwa mali hapa hivi mali hapa sasa ni mali pa ku toa miche sakawa pale ikuje iwekwe mali hapa na hapa ndio inatunzwa mpaka inakuwa tayari inachukuliwa shambani so kawa hapa hivi inachukua uktransplant unaleta mali hapa unaweka kwa hii tubes alafu inachukua mwezi uh, eight months to 10 inakuwa tayari inachukuliwa kwa shamba as a youth group, Underreed started out with different farming activities such as poultry keeping, which did not work out well for them. Therefore, they decided to do coffee nursery farming because they wanted to eradicate the tea farming monotony in their area and introduce coffee to the farmers, which does well in Nandi County. Silas, a member of Underreed Youth Group, explains how they came up with the idea of coffee farming and exclusively doing coffee nurseries. Tulichakua kawa kwa sababu tukiona katika history ya wasasi wetu. Wasasi wetu walipenda machani chai sana. Sisi tukiwa vijana, tukaona ya kwamba atutaenda laini moja na, na, na wasasi wetu. Tukaona ni projekani ambayo tutafanya kama, wana, kama vijana, ambayo tutafanya ikiwa ni unique na ile ya wasasi wetu. Na hii project iku ina, inatupatia mapato. So tukaona kawa ni mzuri. Having a coffee nursery has engaged the youth group into giving farmers tips on how to do proper coffee farming in Nandi County. They teach upcoming coffee farmers how to handle and manage the coffee trees in the nursery beds. Kawa ikiwa kwenye nursery. Lasima kawa ipate maji. Kawa lasima iwekwe maji mara mbili. Asubuhi na jioni. Na pia kawa lasima ichungwe uh, mambo na weeds ama makuku. Ili isikuje isi ika, ikachukua uh, nutrients sa hii kawa. Na pia kawa kuna magonjwa mbalimbali za kawa. Kawa Lasima ichungwe pia kutokana na hiyo magonjwa. Na kila kawa tena ikiwa kwa nazari, lasima ifanyue kitu inaitua scouting. Uone kila mara kama kuna wadudu, kuna, kuna disease simengia. For years, there have only been two coffee varieties in Kenya, 
they are mainly Arabica and Robusta. Since the quality of the traditional varieties was already popular among consumers of Kenya, Roiro 11 was developed with quality attributes similar to traditional varieties Batian. Underrich Youth Group has created nurseries for the Batian coffee crop. They chose the Batian variety as it is disease resistant to the coffee berry disease and it has a fast maturity rate. In Batian, I am going to go to the Batian. I ukifananisha na hizi zingine hii kidogo unaona ah uh, iko health kama hizo zingine hizi kidogo iko na magonjwa iko na plight na kuna wadudu ambao wanakula kawa so zingine sime simetobolewa Shimo, Kwakawa, Yuni Padia, Wadudu, Ambao, Wanakula Kawa. Tunakuja Tunaka Dawa, Amatuna Spray, Dawa Yetu, Hili is Kuliwena Wadudu, Napia, Tuna Spray, Hili, Tupunguze, Ama, Equa Free, Kwamagonjo, Maliapa, Nimalipa, Botting Shit, Maliapa, Ni, uh, Mixing in Afanika Apa Ivi, Kabla Yaku Kufanya Chipping, Ama Kweka, Koiso, Mapolitin, So Apa Ivi, Ukiona Mali Apa Ivi, Kunam Changa, Ama Machanganua, Machangon, eh, Nimchanga, Ama Machanganua, E Nilum Soil, Ama Nimzuri Kwakawa, Machanganua on a sand. Na pia na mbolea ya ngombe au mbuzi. So hapa ni inachanganyo mali hapa hivi uh, kwa ratios. Halafu baada ya kuchanganyo inaweko kwa tubes. Halafu baada ya kuweka kwa tubes inachukuliwa sasa inaenda inapangwa mali pale kwa nazari. Halafu uh, upan, eh, upanze wakawa ama miche in a bando and malipale. So Mchangai in Missouri Kabiza. Wakawa. Not only are they focused on coffee farming, they have used different technologies such as nets to ensure that the coffee trees are well protected from praise and other harmful objects that could lead to insufficient growth of coffee trees. As a group, they have also invested in other forms of technologies they use in their daily agribusiness activities. Umuimu wa kweka neti chu. Kitambo kabisa, tukiwa na nasari ya miti, tukua na shika ama tukua na kata sile uh, majani ya miti, tunayueka juu. Lakini with the new technology ambayo imekuja sasa, tukua ya kwamba uh, net ni mzuri. Kitu, ya, kitu muimu ya net ama kitu ya kwanza ni kwamba net ikona ile Ile light yake, ina regulate your light in a kawa in attacker. So, like this one now, ni a semi kitu 55 per cent. Napia net in a tus idea kwa mambo na elstone. Ukiwa na net kama hii, elstone in apo anguka, ama in apo nyesha, in a kuja in a car, male pale, pale ju. As a youth group, the Underit team has invested in nurturing 5,000 coffee trees in one coffee nursery. This is a gesture of how the group is aggressive in managing the coffee nurseries for farmers to buy from them. They sell coffee seedlings at 20 shillings each. Silas attests that the demand of coffee growing has risen as farmers learn more from the group. The Underit youth group sells approximately 50 to 100 seedlings in a good day. Nasari bed kama hii sasa, tunaweka miche elefutano. Sasa ukiona hii bed mbili, imechukua uh, 10,000 to 12,000. Kitambo kidogo, tumekua na, kumekua kwa na varieties ya kawa. Kama K, K7, 
SL varieties lakini with the new technology kumekuja na two varieties ya kahawa hapa sasa tuko na Roiro 11 na tuko na Batian so hii varieties ni resistant to diseases so hii ndio tumeamua kama wanachama tuwapatie wakulima na ukiona Roiro 11 ni mche ingine ambayo haiendi juu iko tu sai eh, kiasi ambayo iwezi wakati wa wakati inapoiva uh, mkulima hawezi aka akachinyosha sana anafuna tu akiwa mali hapo when preparing a seed bed for coffee trees poly bags are made of black diothene usually 200 meters gauge are commonly used they are filled with a mixture of topsoil, well-rotted cattle manure, coarse sand, gravel, coffee pulp, and coffee husks. Rations used in the bag are a third of each material of the topsoil. Then a top dressing of nitrogen is applied by applying 20 grams of urea in 5 liters of water per meter of bed. Miche ikiwa katika iki karatasi. Mchanga kwanza huwa imechanganywa mahali pale eh, katika kwenye tunaita potting shed inachanganywa uh, mbolea sangombe ama mbuzi alafu inachanganywa na mchanga na uh, sun kidogo na pia inawekwa uh, DSSP kidogo kabla ijawekwa kwa hii tubes Alafu sasa inakuja inayoko kwa hii tubes alafu inakuja inapangwa mahali hapa hivi kwa nazari. A coffee farmer should remove weeds regularly on their coffee nursery bed. This helps the plant to grow well without competing for nutrients. Coffee seedlings should be kept under the shade for 2 months before field planting and gradually remove the shade to sun harden them. The coffee seedlings need to be checked regularly and away from pests and diseases. Unatoa uh, makuku ili isiaribu kawa, unatoa sote kabisa. Usuri ya kweka uh, nasari ikue one meter, umuimu wake ni ili wakati unapo toa makuku, usisumbuke sana. Hiyo unafikia mali pale, ukia upande ili ngine, unafikia upande ili tena. Isi sasa uh, imekuwa iki transferiwa juzi, ijakaa sana, about three weeks, maali hapa hivi. At Underrate Youth Group Coffee Nursery Farm, they have divided into groups and stages which the coffee plant has to undergo for proper management. 